we're back for another Dokkan battle video and uh, Global is in full swing. Uh, the entirety now of part two is out here on Global Dokkan. Um, so with that, right, we have the top legendary summon banner, which I do strongly advise you guys to skip. Um, you guys know I, my thoughts are always going to be exactly the same for these shitty legendary summon banners, which is do not summon. You are asking for trouble, asking for misery, asking for pain, asking to be shafted is what happens when you summon on these banners, right? You want to be very, very, very careful, right? Um, but uh, during the six year anniversary, you know, we have access to these tons of thank you tickets, right? Which um, we can go ahead. It basically, it creates an exact replica of all three banners, the top legendary summon banner, all the LRs are on here, right? You have the UI Goku banner, and then you have the LR Evolution Blue Vegeta banner. I'm gonna do one multi on all three um, with the tons of thank you tickets. Um, we'll see if we get anything good, and then I'll finish out these last, you know, 500 or so stones I've got um, over on the uh, 17 and Golden Frieza banner, um, and we will see how it's going to look. So, all right, let's see. Oh, uh, we did get an SSR, a pretty mid one that doesn't matter at all, but okay. The free SSR? Yeah. Oh, wow, we get two, okay, sure. Um, but both are honestly not really that usable. All right, now we'll use a tons of thanks uh, multi here on the UI Goku banner. Now again, for these tickets, I really would encourage you just to go for whatever you want. Um, I think a smart thing to do would be dump all of your anniversary, like all the stones you're going to use during this anniversary, you dump into, um, whatchamacallit, like like the Dokkan Fest banner, so the Goku and Vegeta banner, and then the only, like, you know, sort of like summons you do on the top legendary summon banner be these tickets. I think that actually would be a very smart idea, a very good idea, right, to just sort of do it in that fashion, to only just sort of put your, your thank you tickets um, into, uh, like, like, like the legendary summon banner and then just pop all your stones. Um, even though we know that it seems like Worldwide Donald Celebration is going to be mega hype with a Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, it seems like, and an Omega Shenron, um, even still, I think, like, you know, like, no matter what, right, let's say, you know, Gogeta and Omega are, like, the two best units in the game or something like that, we don't, we can't say for sure that their banners are going to be better than these anniversary banners. We can't say for sure that those characters are better than these characters. So, okay, we're going to get a featured unit here, which is good. I, I would be shell-shocked. LR. We yeah, we're, or no, this is an exclusive. Um, I would be shell-shocked, dude, if we got... If that was a god animation on five-unit multi. We got three SSRs. All right, who is this? Ah, okay. Uh, I mean, that's, you know, we're gonna, we're, oh, well, actually, oh, another thing I should mention, uh, global players, is that, remember, any units you pull with these tickets, you cannot trade them in for coins, right? Here, let me just quickly, let me quickly go show this off. Um, any characters like that, you cannot trade for coins, see, right? Th there's nothing we can trade for coins. Like, like, the newest SSR, we just got that Gohan, we can't trade him. Right? The reason is because you did not use stones to get him. You can only trade characters for coins if you directly got them with stones. Right? So, you know, just getting them from uh, these banners uh, like w with your tickets do not count. Because I've gotten a lot of questions, a lot of tweets and stuff like that asking that. Like, why can't I trade this unit for coins? It's because you got them from the free multi or you got them from tickets. Right, you want to well, global players especially, right? All right, what is this? Oh, good, yeah, great. Um, global players especially, right? It's very important you want to keep this in mind that, um, you know, when you're like when you're pulling extra copies and stuff like that. So like you know, remember you had the UI Goku banner. You also you know you had the three plus one free multi. You want to be very certain which copy you get like from the free multi and which one you get from stone multis, right? So let's say you do, you know, you pull, um, Super Saiyan 4 Goku seemed to be a very pop, like everyone was pulling him like crazy. Let's say you pull the last one you needed from stones and then you feed him in and then the very next multi on the free multi, you pull him again. But the one you got from the free one, you can't trade in for coins. The one you got from the stone one, you could. So if you feed in the one you got for free into your dupes, then you could trade the one you got from stones for coins. 
So, you know, you do have to be very, very smart about it. And, like, honestly, I think the system is fine. Um, I don't think it's an issue, right? Like, oh, it's not fair that it's like that. I, I don't... It, it's not an issue, right? I, it, the, the system is designed to give you value for your stones when you're pulling units you already have rainbowed, right? Um, I mean, I, I, I think the system is fine, but it just requires you to pay attention, right? Everyone likes to laugh. Oh, it's a bubble popper. Oh, your, your Dragon Ball Z Candy Crush. <laughs> but then, like, come on, like, okay. Like, if that's true and this game requires zero intelligence and stuff like that, then let's, you know, make sure we're, you know, using our dupes and stuff like that wisely, right? You know, we're putting our, you know, the, the ones you got from stones, you're holding on to in case you want to, you know, trade them for coins. And then the ones from the free multi, those ones you immediately want to, like, feed in. Because, um, again, any units you get from the free multi or for tickets, uh, you will only be able to, uh, you know, just trade those in for Baba points. Now, Baba points are definitely si What? Huh. Okay. There's no way. Could you imagine UI Goku right here? <laughs> okay so that's what that feels like huh okay wow well <laughs> sure okay uh all right uh so my tons of thank you tickets uh came through <laughs> okay sure <laughs> i'm gonna finish up a couple of summons here uh the 17 and golden freezer banner and then we'll finish up uh let me know how you guys did. i can't believe that wow all right uh now uh, remember when i tell people like don't you do single summons you're a dummy if you do single summons, I'm not talking about, like, tickets, right? Like, uh, like to be very clear, because it's like, when you use a 50 stone, like, multi, you're getting a guaranteed SSR at the end, which could be, like, you know, the physical Super Saiyan 2 Gohan, who just got an EZA, who's a must-run on the Kamehameha team. You can get, like, Skinny uh, Boo, you can get, like, Boo Piccolo, right? Like, there's a lot of really good characters um, that potentially could be your guaranteed SSR at the end, right? But, like, you know, if you just do a million singles... What's going to happen is you're going to go, you know, 13 singles in a row without an SSR. You're leaving multiple SSRs on the table, right? Now, again, remember that the guaranteed SSR um, is only... Uh, I've had very good luck so far on these global summons tonight. Uh, have been pretty lucky. This is a guaranteed LR. What? Okay. Wow, this is a pretty good video, huh? <laughs> sure. All right, so that's a, that's a dupe for 17 and Golden Freezer right there. I mean, I'll take it, right? Um, This unit is definitely highly limited, but I, I wouldn't say they're bad. I mean, they're probably within discussion for top... How high up would I put them? Top 40 units in the game, maybe? Maybe. Yeah, like, I don't know, like, like somewhere in the top 40 units in the game, top 35, probably 17 in Golden Frieza. Um, there's at least one stage where they really will really help a lot with. And I think that's the reps of Universe 7 um, GT Legendary Goku event mission. Um, I think they would be, I they're, they're, they're a really strong unit for that. The only thing with that mission, right, is global players, as soon as you get the part three EZAs, like, uh, you know, LR, Goku, and Frieza, if you got them. Do we get enough SSRs? God damn. Um, but, like, you know, again, like, LR, Goku, and Frieza, um, LR, Roshi, TN, and Roshi, Physical, UI, Goku, all of those characters dominate uh, that mission for the GT Legendary Goku event. So it's really not that hard to get done, right? Um, provided you have pulled, or excuse me, provided you farmed up these really good free-to-play EZA units, right? Again, they're very, very good, um, a lot of them. Uh, the free units are, like, just beyond belief. All right, this is looking like fodder. Oh, he's featured. We did That Android 17 is featured. Again, this is why I tell people not to summon on this terrible banner in particular, is because all of the units you're pulling featured is just, like, dog shit, like these terrible 17s and Frieza's who, like, are, like, all aged out. Wow. Another LR. And Vegito Blue? Very rare animation. 
Vegito blue is not common, man. Okay. All right, what do we got right here? Give me something good. 17 golden Frieza again. I actually, I, 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 what? I, well, I, I mean, it's better than something I'd have rainbowed. Okay, that's not it. Looks like it's unfeatured. Oh, yeah, that's. I mean, they're kind of poopy. Um, although I did the future no item run was, you know, in large part because of them. Yeah. Okay. That's. I mean, at least I, we can use. It's an LR we can use. So, I mean, I'll take it. Um, but you know, again, I, I, I've talked about this a lot too. Remember that, like, you know, the first two dupes give huge power buffs, right? Like when you're able to get abilities like additionals and crits and stuff like that, right? Those are like really, really big um, abilities. Um, but like, you know, the last two dupes are not like, like, oh, I gotta, you know, go out of my way, use thousand stones to get those last two dupes. Like you're getting like some stat bonuses, but it's the abilities, the crits and additionals and stuff like that. That is like really making your characters a lot stronger. So definitely remember that. I'm probably going to buy, um, I think I'm going to unplug and I'm going to buy seven stones in a second here. Um, and then, uh, we shall finish up or maybe I can grab seven out of the gift box. Hold on. Give, give me two seconds. Cause I want to, um, I think we're going to do four more multis and then I'm done with this banner for good. I'm done summoning on global. Uh, I'll summon on global for super saiyan four Gogeta and Omega Shenron. Um, for the Worldwide Download Celebration. Those will be my next global summons. Um, Alright. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, fodder multi. That AGL Bojack, by the way. That was, like, one of, like, the first 30 characters I got the full level 10 links or something like that. And, God, does he suck. <laughs> He's horrible. Oh, poor Bojack. Even with his great link set, right? Because a lot of those links give huge, huge um, buffs. Right? Like, you know... Um, galactic warrior and stuff like that but even with all that like that bojack is still ass he's just so old right that all right there's that trunks who's on crossover they could give that trunks a sick awakening if they did like a kakarot like crossover right because in that dlc they have like you know um trunks fighting like Deborah and bobbity and stuff like that um well, super saiyan 2 trunks from the Deborah fight that would be a sick uh, awakening um for that trunks right there i think that would be a really good idea for them to do all right two more multis oh that metal real though by the way very good uh if we didn't have him rainbowed Ooh, okay 17 can we get lr universe 7 i would have loved this zeno i love the little the zeno the, the seeing the two zenos pop up uh, that's that's like a uh just a feeling that i love i do love all right what do we got come on Provide the luck. Ugh, not him. I've pulled that Frieza like 50 times already. That STR Namek Frieza. Who, I mean, he could still put up good attack numbers, but you have to run him in slot one, and he is going to get you uh, eviscerated. Let me just quickly see. Again, I want to just grab seven stones out of the gift box real quick. Uh, which I can. Boom. That right there. That right there. And bam. Perfect. All right. Last multi. Let's see if we can end on Universe 7. Uh, I mean, this has been a good video. We've already got 17 in Golden Frieza. Already got an AGL UI Goku. Um, all right. Looks like no crazy luck right here. So let me know how you guys did. Um, tweet me your pulls to that tweet on this banner if you want to. Um, you know, if you get any anything good from the Rainbow Tickets, tweet, you know, maybe you get UI Goku or Vegeta or something like that from the tickets. Sure, tweet at me. Because, I mean, on JP, I got Team Universe 7. And then on global, I got UI Goku. So, definitely worked out pretty well. All right, the last multi. Oh, ending on Chow Man, huh? All right, we're done. Thanks, guys, for watching. Love y'all. Goodbye. Adios.